Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and welcome to today's Morning Ramble. And today I wanted to share a story, and it's been one of my favorite stories for years. And it's a story about my friend uh, and colleague Aaron Turner, who's been teaching this understanding for, I don't know, it's going to be coming up on a couple decades. And he was teaching a, a course in a company, in a corporation, and most of the people were, at, at the very least, polite when they came in. And uh, there was one guy who was not. He he made it very clear through his body language and his harumphing that he did not want to be there. And, you know, he, he at one point actually opened a newspaper in the middle of the class and just started reading. And, you know, Aaron couldn't help but clock him, but he's doing his best to share this understanding that we share about how our experience is being created by thought and how beyond thought there is a, there's a whole other level of being. And, and when you approach life from that place, not only does it just feel more alive and more real, but you're more effective, which is why he was teaching it in a corporation. And in the first break, he went up to the guy to see if he could kind of find out what was going on. And, and, and he said, you, 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 is something up? And, and, and the guy said, oh, it's just, you know, I'm sorry, but this is, you know, I already know this stuff. You know, I, 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 I feel like I just don't want to have to sit through the basics again. And Aaron said, oh, well, there is an advanced course. And the guy went, oh, I knew it. Okay, well, what's the advanced course? And Aaron said, well, the advanced course is the same as the basic course, but with better listening. Now, putting aside that it's such a great line, I, I, I have always felt like the biggest distraction to really getting something is that there are so many other things to get. There's so many other cool ways that people have said it that in chasing sort of new and different, we can easily miss out on the depth of ancient and the same. When you're talking about the wisdom of the ages, New and different might wake you up a bit. It might help make it fresh. In fact, I, I know it does. But actually, the fundamental truth never changes. So while I still have many of these, and if I turn the camera around, you'll see many more of them. There are a couple thousand less of them than there have been over the years. And... And gradually, I'm finding that one good book read and reread and reread with better listening makes more of a difference to me than next, 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 next. Now, I keep writing books, so please understand. <laughs> I'm not anti new and fresh. I just think there really is something to be said to bringing deeper and deeper listening to things that have already moved you in the past. Now, for those of you interested in exploring this further with me, I am doing a course called the Advanced Course. And uh, it's a lot like the Basic Course with better listening, if you bring that. But it's, it's really based on the idea that the, if the Basic Course is just showing us our divine engineering, our divine architecture, how well we're made. The advanced course is saying, no, really. So if you're interested, I hope you'll come check it out. You can find out more at uh, michaelneal.org. Uh, it begins tomorrow. And then there's an advanced, advanced course, which is a four month version, which uh, called Going Deeper. And you can find out about that at michaelneal.org as well. Until next time, have fun, learn heaps. And I'll talk with you soon.